it going guys, Sharblox here. So I wanted to make a quick video about this accessory settings removal update, simply because I haven't seen anyone else talk about this yet. I tried looking on Twitter to see if anyone else was saying anything, but nope. I might have been looking in the wrong place or searching with the incorrect keywords, but from what I can tell guys, nobody else has mentioned this update on any social media. So either that means this update is irrelevant to everyone, or maybe it's fairly new. Maybe Roblox added these changes fairly recently. I really don't know. Now for me personally, this update is pretty annoying and that's why I ended up discovering it. So yeah, let me explain to you guys what's happening and I'll show you guys what Roblox did. So for example, guys, you're over on the avatar shop. If you go ahead and select literally any Roblox accessory, let's use this one for an example, the Motocross 91 Skull. It looks pretty cool. So let me go ahead and buy this for 91 Robux. Now guys, normally when you purchase a Roblox accessory, it will give you access to a settings option. I'm sure most of you will know this, maybe some of you won't. And basically guys, clicking on this settings option used to let you do several things. You could wear it on your avatar, you could delete it from your account. If it's a limited, you could sell it. I believe at one point you could report items as well. However, now guys, all of those options have been removed except for add to profile, pretty much making this option thing kind of obsolete. I guess adding accessories to your profile is kind of cool, also kind of pointless though. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about when I say profile accessories, as you can see in my collections, this was stuff I added to my profile. So yeah, for an example, if I go ahead and click on add to profile, it will say added to your profile. And then there you go, guys, over on my collections, as you can see, the item is now here. Like I was saying, this feature is okay. It's cool if you want to display your UGC stuff, which you made or something. I guess it's cool for displaying limiteds as well. But for most people, nobody really cares about this. And yeah, that's the only option we have left. Unless you own a limited accessory, then you can also sell it. So you could click on sell. I don't have Roblox Premium, so unfortunately, I cannot sell this but yeah you guys can see what i mean nearly all of the options have now gone it is slightly different on ugc accessories i'm pretty sure we can report them so there you go you can also report item if this user was breaking the rules so i could report it and say you stole that from supreme <laughs> no i'm just kidding but if somebody uploaded a dodgy ugc item yeah you can report it if you want to now the option that used to say delete from inventory that used to appear on roblox accessories then roblox removed it and then for a short while it was only available on ugc items so if you bought a UGC thing and you didn't want it, you could delete it. I can actually understand why Roblox removed this one, simply because people's accounts would get hacked and the hackers would go onto their UGC items and delete them just to be mean. Yeah, some hackers are really horrible like that. So yeah, like I was saying, I can understand why Roblox removed this option, but what about the wear option? Why on earth would Roblox remove that? Because for me personally, guys, this wear option was really useful for making thumbnails. Let's use this accessory for an example. So a chessboard. I think this accessory is really old. It was probably made in like 2007. So yeah, basically guys, I purchased this thing on my Roblox account years ago, but because the wear option is now gone, I will literally have to scroll through my entire inventory just to find this. And I've got no idea where it was. So like I was saying, when I was making thumbnails, the wear option was actually very useful if I wanted to equip something which I couldn't really find. My inventories are just full of random hats. I don't even care about most of them. But the thing is, if I was looking for something, like something specific, specific, which I already own, and I want to use it in a thumbnail or something like that, well guys, it would take me such a long time just to find this accessory, which is honestly kind of annoying. To be fair, there is two extra options that I just want to talk about quickly. This one is configure and advertise, but you only get these options if you actually created a UGC item. If you don't have UGC access, these options won't appear for you. But yeah, guys, it's honestly kind of sad to see Roblox removing more features. I feel like stuff should be getting added to the website, not really deleted. But there you go, Roblox have been deleting features for quite a while now. But so that's pretty much it for this video. I just wanted to show you guys that Roblox was deleting stuff. Like I said, I used to use this for making avatar thumbnails. You know, I was able to quickly find an item, then equip it on my avatar. But now I can't do that. And yes, it is kind of annoying. But if you guys found this video interesting, as always, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.